Good morning, good morning, first hour prayer, bam! Come on in, come on in, come on in, come on in. <laughs> come on in, you guys. Good morning, good morning, good morning. This is the day that the Lord has made. We will, we shall rejoice in it it come on in tag share let somebody know that we are on this morning come on in good morning good morning good morning good morning um <laughs> if this is your first time welcome and if it's not welcome again i am sitting in for pastor jackson on this morning so go ahead and just share and tag. Let somebody know that we're on. Hit your if you're on Facebook, hit your likes, your hearts, your smiley faces, um, your shout mouths, <laughs> tag, share. And if you're on um YouTube, just go ahead and share the link. Somebody really, really wants to probably hear this. Amen. <laughs> good morning, Patty. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning, Darlene. If I don't see your names, please forgive me. It's not, I just if I don't call your name, please forgive me. It's just I don't see you. Good morning, Cynthia. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Virtual anointing this morning is deeper. Hashtag deeper, deeper. Good morning, Dasha. Good morning, Chantel. Good morning. Um, deeper. Hashtag deeper, 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 deeper. We're going deeper. And the question is, are you willing to go deeper? Oh, that's good. Are you willing to go deeper? Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. You guys come on in. I see Shakira. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Tammy. Good morning. Um, virtual anointing is deeper. If you want your prayer tools, please go to www.jameswjacksonministries.com. <laughs> that was long. James W. Jackson Ministries.com. Fill out your information. They will send it out to you, whatever you want. Amen. Good morning. Good morning, Tammy, again. <laughs> oh, good morning, Patty. Good morning. Good morning, Sarah. Good morning, you guys. I'm sitting in for Pastor Jackson. We're giving him a break. Amen. So you guys keep him in your prayers. We love him so much. He does so much for us um, when he prays. And when I say he's he's a man that covers us, amen, that's him. That is him. Good morning, Brenda. Good morning. Good morning, you guys. Come on in. Um, Like I said, tag, share. Let somebody know that we're on. We're going in. We're going to go in deeper this morning. Um. Psalms 102 says, enter into his gates with thanksgiving and into his courts with praise. And that's exactly what we do. So if this is your first time, this is what we do every morning at 715. We have one at 630 uh, on Facebook. If you have not followed Pastor Jackson, please go follow him. He might not be able to um, accept you as a friend, but you can follow him. And then we have it at 715. So um, we just thank you for joining us. And we thank you for just being a part of First Hour Prayer. Amen. Pass me not, O oh, gentle Savior, hear my humble cry, while others thou art calling. Oh God, please don't pass me by. I'm calling Savior, Savior. Hear my humble cry while others thou art calling. Do not pass me by. I'm calling Savior, Savior. Oh God, hear my humble cry while others thou art calling do not pass me by hallelujah oh god we thank you we thank you that you hear our cry we thank you oh god that when we call your name that you hear us oh god 
Oh, God, we love you on this morning. We thank you, oh, God, that we can call your name. Oh, God, we just thank you because you've been so good to us. You have been so, so good to us. We thank you, Father God, that we know you as our Father. We know you as Abba. We know you. We believe in you, oh God. We thank you, oh God, that you are cre you are our creator. You created us to worship you. You created us to lift up your name. You created us to give your glory, oh God, and that's what we're doing on this morning. We thank you, oh God, that you are our deliverer. You are our everlasting father. You are faithful, oh God, to us. And God, for that, we say thank you. We thank you, oh God, that you are God all by yourself and you do all things good and perfect, oh God. You do all things good and perfect. We thank you, oh God. We call you holy on this morning. Holy are you, oh God. We thank you, oh God, that you are an incredible God. You are an incredible God. You are a just God. You are a kind God. You are a loving God. You're a merciful God. Oh God, we thank you that you never leave us nor forsake us, oh God. We thank you, oh God, that you are an omnipotent. You're omnipotent. You're always there, oh God. We thank you, oh God, that you're powerful. We thank Thank you, oh God, that you have all power. You are full of power. We thank you, oh God, that you are quick to answer. You are quick to turn things around, oh God. We thank you, oh God, and we love you. We thank you, oh God, that you are a restorer. You restore, you restore us, oh God. We thank you, oh God. Even when we lose things, you still restore us, oh God. We thank you, God, that we serve a strong and mighty God. We thank you, oh God, that you're trustworthy. We thank you, oh God, that you always provide for us. Oh God, we love you. We thank you that you have victory. And because you have victory and you live in us, we have victory. Oh God, we thank you that we can walk in victory in anything that we do, in everywhere that we go. Oh God, we will walk in victory. Victory shall be ours. Why? Because we know you and because we love you and because we trust you. Oh Oh God, oh God, and because you are our confidence, you are our hope, oh God, we will walk in victory, 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 victory. Oh God, we thank you that you are so wonderful and you are so excellent. Oh God, we just adore you. We adore you on this morning. You said daily, daily, daily will I praise you. Oh God, daily will we praise you. We will praise you daily. Oh God, we just love you on this morning and we just give you the glory. We give you the honor. Oh God, you are our God. Oh God, you are our God. We just love you. We honor you. We bless you. Oh God, we just want to just say thank you on this morning. Thank you. Oh God. Thank you, thank you, thank you, because we want to go deeper into you, deeper into you, oh God, oh my God, deeper into you, hallelujah. Y'all, virtual anointing is deeper, deeper, and the question is, are you willing to go deeper? Are you willing to go deeper? Good morning, everybody. Good morning. Good morning. Thank you for joining me. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. I am just sitting in for Pastor Jackson on this morning. So we're going to go here and we're going to go. We're going to go in. We're about to go in. We're about to go in. This blessed me at 630. Oh, my God. And I hope it blesses you all. 715. Amen. Deeper. Colossians 2, verse 6 through 8. And it says, I have called you back from the ends of the earth. Nope. That's not where I want to go. Mm -mm, that's my last verse. Stop. Okay. Colossians 2. Sorry, you guys. Um, and it says, verse 6 says, and now, just as you accepted Jesus Christ as your Lord, you must continue to follow him. Now that you accepted Jesus Christ as your Lord, you must continue to follow him. Verse 7 says, let your roots grow down into him. And let your lives be built on him. Let your lives be built on him. Then your faith will grow strong 
in the truth you were taught and you will overflow with thanksgiving. Oh my God. Oh my God. Now that we have Jesus Christ in us, we must continue to follow him. So no matter what we go through, no matter what it looks like, we must continue to follow him. I don't care how long ago you said, God come into my heart. Whoa! You got to continue to follow him. He said, let your roots grow down into him and let your lives be built on him. Then once your life is built on him, then your faith will grow strong in the truth you were taught and you will overflow with thanksgiving. You will overflow with love. You will overflow with peace. That's why we got to stay in there. Verse Verse eight says, don't let anyone capture you with empty philosophies and high sounding nonsense that comes from human thinking and from the spiritual powers of this world rather than Christ. So no matter what, listen, quit listening to everybody else. They, if they ain't talking about the word, if they ain't talking about God, it don't mean nothing. It means nothing because it's empty. Woo! It means nothing. God's promises, God's words are promises. God's words is sufficient. God's word is full. So it, the other stuff is empty. It means nothing to us. Oh God, we thank you for your word on this morning. Oh God, we thank you that we accepted you into our lives. We thank you, oh God. We thank you that you live in us. And because you live in us, help us to follow you, oh God. Help us to continue to follow you no matter how long long we've known you oh god help us to go deeper into your word help us to go deeper into you oh god let our roots grow into you oh god let our lives be built on you oh god so that our faith can grow strong so our faith can grow strong oh god oh god we thank you that you are the true and living god your word is alive today oh god we thank you for your word oh god even when people try to come to us oh god with empty promises oh god and it may sound good oh god let us remember your word let us remember your word oh god in the name of jesus your word is the only word that we need. Your word is the only thing that is fulfilling, oh God. Oh my God. Thank you, oh God, for your word. We thank you, oh God, for the overflow. Because we believe in you, because our faith grows in you, we have overflow. Thank you, oh God, for the overflow. Oh my God. We just love you on this morning and we thank you for this word, oh God. We thank you, oh God. Help us to just be entangled into you. Oh God, let our roots entangle into you, oh God. In the name of Jesus, Jeremiah 17 and 7 says, but blessed are those who trust in the Lord. Listen to me. We accepted Christ into our lives. We're going to continue to follow him. Right. Um, He said, let our roots grow down into him. So now bless. Now we trust him. So we're blessed. But blessed are those who trust in the Lord. And have the Lord and have made the Lord their hope and confidence. They are like trees planted along the riverbanks with roots that reach deep into the water. Such trees are not bothered. Such trees are not bothered by the heat or worry or worry about long months of drought. Their leaves stay green and they never stop producing fruits. Stop it. Oh my God. So guess what? We're blessed. We're blessed. Why? Because we trust God. We're blessed. No matter how it looks, you're blessed. No matter how it looks, you're blessed. You're blessed. Why? Because you trust God. You have made the Lord your hope and confidence. Y'all listen to me. As we continue to walk this walk, we have to just know that we have to trust God no matter what. We have to know that he is our hope, that he is our confidence. We got to make him that. We just can't say, oh yeah, he's our hope and he's our confidence. No, you got to make sure that you know. I know that he's my hope. I know that he's my confidence. Listen to me, because I'm blessed. Why? Because I trust him. Ha! You are blessed because you trust him. He said, be like the plant by the river banks. Come on, y'all. That's why he wants us to go deeper into him. Don't worry. Don't worry about the heat. Don't be bothered by the heat. Don't be bothered by the people. Don't be bothered by them. Don't be bothered by what's going on in your life. 
He said, stay right there. Listen, be entangled in him, be entangled in his word. He said, your leaves will stay green and you will produce. You will not stop producing. So no matter what comes our way, we will not stop producing fruit. That's what he wants us to do. He wants us to produce fruit. Father God, we thank you. We thank you that we trust you. And we thank you that we're blessed because we trust you. We are blessed because we trust you. Oh my God. Thank you, oh God, that you are our hope and that you are our confident, oh God. We are confident in you. We are confident in you. Oh my God. Thank you, God. Help us to be like the trees that's planted by the river banks, oh God. Help us, oh God, to draw deeper into you, to draw closer into you, oh God, to draw closer into your world word. Oh God. Oh God, we would not be wor- we would not be worried about anything that comes our way. We would not be bothered by whatever comes our way. You said we would not be bothered by the heat. That means we will not be bothered by the issues. We will not be bothered by the problems, oh God. Oh God, we will not be bothered. And no matter how long it takes for you to deliver us, no matter how long it takes for you to heal us, oh my God, no matter how long, oh God, we will stay green. We will we will produce fruit, oh God, in the name of Jesus. So no matter what, oh God, help us to know that we will stay green, that we will produce because we love you. We will produce because we trust you. We will produce because we have faith in you. We will produce, oh God, because we have hope in you, because our confidence is in you, oh God. We will stay green. We will stay green, oh God. Our leaves will not go nowhere, oh God. They won't even turn a little bit of brown. Oh my God. Oh my God. Oh God, we just love you on this morning. We will stay green. We will stay green and we will produce, oh God, in the name of Jesus. Isaiah 41 and 9 says, I have called you back from the ends of the earth, saying, you are my servant. (laughs) You are my servant. (laughs) For I have chosen you and I will not throw you away. So listen to me. He said, I have called you back from the ends of the earth. So when I think of that, I think of, listen, no matter what you're going through. Yeah, you you fail. You, 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 You fail. You fail. Pick yourself back up. I ain't going to throw you away. He said, I'm not going to throw you away. I've chosen you. I've chosen you. So no matter what, I have chosen you. I will not throw you. I will not throw you, throw you away. He said, you are my servant. He said, I've called you. He called us by our names. Oh my God. Verse 10 says, Do, don't be afraid for I am with you. Don't be discouraged for I am your God. I will strengthen you and help you. I will strengthen you, Patty, and help you. <laughs> when you may not know what's, what's, how to do it, I will strengthen you and I will help you. Oh, this is good. Verse, um, and so at the end it says, I will hold you up with my victorious right hand. That's why we got, that's why we're able to walk in victory. Verse 11 says, see, are your enemies lie there confused and humiliated? Y'all stop. Don't worry about them. They can't get where you at. They confused. They're so confused. Your enemies are so confused. They they want they trying to think like, how you get right there? Don't worry about that. Because see, I trust God. He said in his word, blessed are those who trust him. So that's why your enemies don't matter. They don't matter. They're confused. Just keep on going. Just keep on trusting in God. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. God, we thank you. We thank you, oh, God, that you called us your servant. We thank you, oh, God, that you chose us, that you called us by your name, oh, by our names, oh, God. Oh, God, we thank you, oh, God, that even when we fall, that you will not throw us away. Oh, God, even when we confuse, you will not throw us away, oh, God. Oh, God, we just thank you that you love us so much that you will not throw us away. Oh, God, help us. Help us to deal with what we have to deal with, oh God. Help us to not be afraid. Help us to not be discouraged, oh God. You said, don't be afraid for you are with me. You said, don't be discouraged for you are our God. And God, I thank you right now. God, help us, oh God, even when we do be afraid for the little bit, the little bit of 
being afraid of whatever it is oh god even when we're discouraged oh god help us to remember your word you said i am with you and you are our god oh god you said you will strengthen us and you will help us oh god and god i ask you right now to give us strength oh god help us Help us, oh God. Help us to do what you want us to do. Help us to go over what you want us to do, oh God. In the name of Jesus, help us to know that we can walk in victory, oh God. Oh God, because you said you will hold us up with your victorious right hand, oh God. Thank you for your victory in the name of Jesus. Oh God, we shall walk in victory on this morning. We shall walk in victory. We shall go deeper into you, oh God. Help us to go deeper into your word, oh God. Oh God, you said it in your word and that's what we're gonna stand on, oh God. Oh God, you said don't listen to those out there in the world, oh God. But you said listen to you, oh God. Help us to listen to your word. Help us to do your word oh god oh god i ask you right now in the name of jesus to keep us to keep us and so that we can go deeper into you plant us deeper oh god in the name of jesus oh god that we will never turn brown that our leaves will always stay green Oh my God, that we will always keep producing fruit, oh God. You said blessed are those who trust you and we trust you, oh God. We trust you, oh God. We believe in you, oh God. Help us, oh God, to stay in your word no matter what comes our way, oh God. No matter what the situation is, oh God, help us to trust you. Help us to trust your word. Help us to go deeper in you, oh God. Let us say your words, oh God. When we don't know what to say, let us remember your word. Let the words come out of our mouths. Let the words come out of our hearts, oh God. That is only you, oh God. Your word is fulfilling. Your word is full of joy. Your word is alive, oh God. And that's why we can stand on your word. Oh God, help us on this morning to remember your word. Remember your word, oh God. In the name of Jesus, oh God, we thank you and we love you. We just honor you for your word, oh God. We trust you. Oh yes, we trust you. And that's why we're blessed. That's why we have hope in you. That's why we have confidence in you, oh God. We trust you, oh God. And we give you glory. Hallelujah. We thank you. We thank you. We thank you. Ha! Yes, that was good. Blessed are those who trust him. Don't worry about your enemies. They confuse. They confuse. They want to be where you want to go. They can't get there. Why? Because God called you to be there, not them. <laughs> when I tell you I read that, I was like, oh my God. They're confused. They're humiliated. But you know what? He will not make us ashamed. He will not make us ashamed as long as we trust him. He said it in his word. He said, I will not make you ashamed. Trust me. Love on me. Go deeper in me. Come on, y'all. Let's go deeper in God. Go deeper. And are you willing? The question is, are you willing to go deeper? And my answer is yes. What's yours? <laughs> I love you. I love you. I love you, Lord, today because you cared for me in such a special way. That's why I'll praise you and I'll lift you up and I'll magnify your name. That's why my heart is filled with praise. I love you. I love you. I love you, Lord, today because you cared for me in such a special way that's why i'll praise you and i'll lift you up and i'll magnify your name that's why my heart is filled with praise that's why my heart is filled with praise that's why my heart is filled with praise. Hallelujah.
We love you. Oh, God. Oh, my God. I love you. I love you, God. I love you. Woo! Y'all, this was good. This was good. Go deeper. Hashtag deeper. If you really want to go deeper, go deeper. Hashtag I'm going deeper. No matter what, I'm going deeper. I'm going deeper. I hope and pray that I have encouraged you to say yes and to go deeper in God. I hope that I have said something to say, you know what? I can do this. I can do this. Yes, you can. You can do this. I'm telling you, you can. You can. You can. You guys, I love you. I like you. I love you. You make me smile. Have a great day. And guess what? Tell somebody about God. For real. Tell them your story. Tell them your testimony so that they can know who God is. Amen. Go deeper into him. I love you guys. Have a good day.